my dear Christian friend, I would like to ask you a question. And the question is, do you trust yourself? Do you trust yourself? And the answer to that probably will be um, no, I don't trust myself, I trust Jesus or I trust the Holy Spirit, but I don't trust myself. Now, why don't you trust yourself? What is in you or what are you that makes you so untrustworthy? I want you to think about that. Also, Do you see the great separation, the great chasm that your mind has created between yourself and the Holy Spirit? That is called separation mentality and it's this mentality that has separated us from God and it has orphaned us into an identity that condemns itself as not trustworthy But if you cannot trust your own heart, your own essence of being, what are you? Who are you? And where did you come from? It is truly sad that we are so afraid of ourselves, so distrusting of ourselves, so diminished in value, Um, I know of this because I have come from there, but I have recovered my precious, precious soul. And not only is my soul trustworthy, and not only do I trust myself, I love myself because I know who I am. I am divine spirit inside a human body. I'm a magnificent soul and I'm worthy of trusting myself because I don't see myself as separate from God. I see myself as one with God and even one as God, but that is a little much for most people at this stage. So I'm just giving you a little pre-taste, just a little nibble of a potential conscious awareness that is available, that it is God in you as you, God 
having incarnated as you. And with that conscious awareness, you will have no trouble trusting yourself or loving yourself because you finally realize your true identity. You are so trustworthy. Yourself is so trustworthy and so worthy 